Hi, hi, hi. Welcome back to my channel. Um, you asked for it. Customers requested it. This is the Beast. Diamond Painting Drill Tray. The dimensions are 6 inches and 5 eighths. 6 and 5 eighth inches long. It is 4 inches wide. The tray has a 1 inch gap at the top. Here. The tray has 1 eighth inch thick sidewalls. And the sidewalls are 5 eighth inches high. The grooves in the tray are deeper to help the drills line up better. I promise you, this is not a flimsy tray. I literally put it in the driveway and ran over it with my car to make sure it would not break. That's no joke. How this tray works is you take, slide the lid on into grooves. The, tray do, the lid does not pop on, the tray slides on. You take the plug. As you can see, the plug has a groove on it. The groove faces the inside of the tray. The groove, the little notch, faces the inside of the tray. The straight line faces the outside of the tray. You take, slide the lid on, take the plug, again, make sure the groove is facing the inside of the tray, and you pop it into place, just like that. This plug is designed to be hard to get in and out for a reason. This tray was designed and is designed for moms with kids, people with pets that jump up on their tables, knock over their drill trays, etc. Okay? Again, this was a customer's, custom, many, many customers request. For this size, with the height of the side walls, with the locking plug, and the slide off and on top. You will not break this tray. This tray is literally hard. That is how you do it. You take, all right, I'm going to show you again. Take your thumbnail, put it right here in between the plug and the lid, and you can pop it off, grab both sides, wiggle and pull it out. This is the new and improved plug that has a bigger and wider space for grabbing to pull in, to push in and to pull out. So, there you go. You asked for it. That is the beast. Again, it is six and five eighths inches long it is four inches wide as for drills it's got one inch up here at the top so that when you are trying to put your drills back into your tray all you do is slide the lid on tap it like this Dump your drills into your tray or your container. There you go. It's that easy. Now, when you're ready to put them back in, now, when, you can, when you're diamond painting, you can use it. All you do is slide the lid up and down. 
you can use it like that keep your drills from coming out because again you have to slide the the plug up and down when the lid is not on it uh, to put your drills back in your tray slide the lid on tap it There you go. That's how that's done. Okay, guys. Like I said, cut many, many, many customers requested this. So, there you are. As far as the color, this is the brand new uh, silver chalice that I just uh, added to the store today. Um, so, I have 17 colors to choose from. I just used the silver because it was the brand new one. And... Uh, I wanted to see what it looked like with the tray printed. Anyway, I hope this helps you guys out. Please know I'm always available, and I'm only an email away, or a message away, or a shout away, if you have any questions, or need uh, comments, or suggestions. Have a great day. Bye for now.